Melody Johnson. A couple years back, this Arizona woman tried to poison her husband with bleach. The evidence is on the photo. I know this is bad news Thursday, but we got to just give it, man. Her, her, her husband or boyfriend asked the court, her husband, to, three, to just probation. The court obliged and gave her three years probation. Look at the smile on her face. Look at the smile on her face. Gentlemen, do not blame the ladies anymore. You allow what you allow. Don't blame them. And ladies, don't blame the men. I'm not sexist. Okay? We got a problem upon ourselves. We allow this. I'm going to read the comments and let this go. Of course, she's going to do it again. There's no doubt. Look, look, at her, look, look at the smile. I mean, obviously, she's let go. She's happy. But look at that, man. She tried to kill her husband. Look at it. Oh, my. I want to read the full case. Her next victim. Let's, let's read the full case. We talk immediately. Let's, let's get into the full case, man. It's fucking ridiculous. All right? It's crazy. And I got to make a phone call. Real quick. To God. And ask him how. <laughs> Melody Feliciano Johnson, 40, pleaded guilty last month to two counts of poisoning food or, or drink or for putting trace amounts of bleach into husband Roby Johnson's coffee maker on July 11th and 18th. Tried two times to kill the guy. Dummy. Two times. And, and there goes the video. Roby Johnson uh, put a hidden camera in his kitchen and recorded evidence that his wife was spiking his coffee with chlorine bleach. And the Arizona woman accused of attempting to... Can you imagine the person you fucking marry... That's, that's why I'm so big on these videos. The person that you marry says at some point in time, and that's why, you, only, you know, your mother and father, that's why I love them to death, man. Right? You love them to death. You know, if you have siblings that you were born with, you trust them, you love them to death. Because other than that, guys, it, it's pretty tough. And even there, even there, there's some discrepancy. It's pretty hard to trust people now, man. You marry this person, you're sleeping in bed, you've had intercourse... Maybe you've made kids. You think it's all there. You think you trust them, and they're fucking in the morning. You got, you got, you got, you got chlorine in, in your coffee, so she can kill you, or vice versa, or the husband killing the wife. Is this what society's made of? Let's keep watching this thing, man. Let's, watch, let's turn about, talk about it. An Arizona woman accused of attempting to kill her husband by poison coffee has been sentenced to three-year probation. Okay, Johnson was illicitly charged with attempted first-degree murder in a plea deal. That charge, what is she pleading for? There's no drug kingpins involved with this. It's just her. What is she pleading to? In a plea deal that charge was dropped and she pleaded guilty in April to counsel the felony charge of adding poison or a harmful substance to food or drink. Her husband, Ruby Johnson, last year went to police investigators in Tucson with evidence he had collected after noticing a foul taste of his coffee. He said he pretended to keep drinking the coffee to prepare for him uh, while he pursues his suspicions. He first used pool testing strips and found the coffee showed high levels of chlorine. He then set up a hidden camera that reportedly caught Melody Johnson pouring bleach into the water she used to brew his coffee. At the time, the Johnsons were still living together with their child, but were in the process of getting divorced. Okay. Rory Johnson was stationed. Uh, Air Force. Come on, guy. You're a vet, bro. Come on. The husband told investigators he believed she was trying to kill him to collect death benefits. Oh, fuck. Jesus. <laughs> oh, my God. Ay, 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 ay. Why do you? Didn't I say there's levels to it? You laugh at Roy or Mackle or Roy and and, and Jaden, whatever the basketball player Jalen Green and all these guys, Shaquille O'Neal. The list goes on and on, but it happens at the lower level. You just never hear about it. This problem is systemic. God, the husband told Best Grace he believes she was trying to kill him to collect death benefits. Let's continue. Melody could face a maximum of two years in prison for each count. Her attorney is requested the sentence to be time served, saying Johnson had already been in the custody for nearly a year due to her inability to post a $250,000 bond. Her sentence also included mental health treatment, of course, the easy way out. Judge Javier Sean Lopez, though even the victim had told the court he didn't want Melody to end up in prison. All right? So he just went with it. Oh, my God. Sorry, Roby. I mean, you're, you're doing a disservice. This is another video of her. Look at her. She's dangerous. Look at that face. She's a dangerous girl. Look at her. 
Look at that face. Huh? I love you, huh? Huh? Let's watch the video. It's ridiculous, man. I'm mad. I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't gonna lie to you, guys. I'm, Introducing I'm Alexa Emergency Assist. Hands-free. Fast. 24 7 People suck nowadays, man. I mean, seriously. Uh-huh. Okay, let's play a little bit louder. Boom. Look at it. There goes the kitchen. How's time served? It's, it's... She got arrested in May. That's 522-23 on the video, so... How's that time search she spent a year? She didn't spend a year there. She wasn't in jail right now. Okay, look at her. Look at her. What's she looking around? Hold on, let's go here. All right, there, there it is, there it is. Yep, she poured some chlorine there, not giving a flying shit about her husband at the 130 mile. Let's go back here again. She gets some bleach, she's pouring the bleach. Now she's bringing the bleach. She has a good amount, so it's unnoticeable. Let me kill this motherfucker. Why, I want his, I want his military benefits, you bastard. Get bastard, get bastard. You you fight for your life outside of the country, and you, and you come fight for your life inside the country. What a fucking hellhole, guys. Look at this. I want to see the husband come out where she gives him a kiss and says, "Hey, honey, I love you." Lord have mercy. Oh, they were in Germany. Turned to drink as he did not want to make a report of, his, of this while in Germany. He was stationed there. This pattern of Leslie continued at the Air Force, moved him to the debt. Oh, my God. She's been trying for a long time, guys. Dude, you're crazy, bro. She should not be released. She's been trying for months and months. It's premeditated murder, guys. She will go and kill somebody else. It's unfucking believable, you guys. You guys are sick. You're doing a disservice to the next guy she's with. Now, you know, I know what the ladies are going to say. Well, that's his problem. <laughs> I know you guys. That's his problem, not my, not ours. Now, would you say that is your father, your brother, your cousin, your nephew? Look, look at this nasty. Look at this nasty girl. Oh, man. Look at this nasty, nasty girl, boy. I tell you what. Look at her. She, she, she's probably a nurse and she read up the amount, the proper amount. Fucking bastard. I want the hey babe and a kiss. There you go. There you go, nasty. Nasty. There you go, nasty. There you go, nasty. There you go. Wow. 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 Here, we, here, here go when she's naked doing it. Luckily, he got lucky. He got some chlorine from Florida. <laughs> coin, coin from Florida might as well be water, so it wasn't gonna work, darling. <laughs> he got, he got, he luckily, God blessed him with some chlorine from fucking Florida, <laughs> which is just as good as water. <laughs> oh man, I'm out of here after this, guys. Let's see what she's doing in nasty. Look, look at her. Look at her. Look, look, look. She's looking around. Look at her. Look at her. 
Yeah, look at her. She just had. She just finished doing the do with him. She has a little outfit on, butt naked. She just finished giving him some. That's how. That's how she knew she could go do it because he was knocked out. You see. You see. You see. Tattoo on the back though. Tattoo on the on the leg too. You see. Boom! Look at this nasty. Look at her. Huh? Huh? Oh, I can't smell it. It should be okay. Nasty girl. Ah. Guys, God bless. Have a good one. In my opinion, when somebody commits a crime like that and you let them go, you're basically enticing them to do it again. We talk in media. I'm out, man. It's fucking sick.